After power on, configure the motor parameters first. The functions of the three buttons from left to right are next. Enter M menu. Select mode, menu, mode, CR, VFOC. Select the baud rate, menu. You are baud, 38,400. Select address, menu. You are better, 01. Open example code 1, plus move with Arduino. The code has detailed comments, and the code can be modified according to requirements. Click tools, ORs, Arduino AVR boards, Arduino you know. Click tools, port, and select the corresponding port. Click the upload button in the upper left corner to compile and upload. After the upload is successful, the lowered information bar will display. After the program runs, the motor can be observed to run. The LED light is on, and the motor is turning a circle. The LED light is off, and the motor rotates in reverse. So in this cycle, Open the example code to read real-time location. Select the board as Arduino you know. Select the port corresponding to the device. The serial port is shared with the USB download port. Unplug the serial port cable before uploading the program. Click the upload button. After the program is uploaded successfully, connect the serial cable again. Then press the reset button of the UNO board. Click Tools, Serial Monitor. Set the baud rate to 38,400. You can receive the real-time position data of the motor. Turn the motor manually, and you can observe the change of position information. Open example code 3, read real-time speed. Check whether the port is selected as Arduino you know. Check whether the port is corresponding to the device. Click the upload button. If the upload fails, you can try to hold down the reset button of UNO and click upload. And release the reset button immediately when uploading is displayed. After the upload is successful, reconnect the serial cable. And press the reset button. Open the serial monitor. The motor runs at a constant speed, changing the speed every 10 seconds. Every time the LED light flashes once, the serial port sends a command to read the real-time speed and return to the serial monitor. Open example code for read the input pulses. After selecting the board and port, click the upload button.
After the upload is successful, reconnect the serial cable and reset you know. Open the serial monitor. The motor runs at a constant speed and changes the speed every 10 seconds. Every time the LED light flickers, the serial port sends a command to read the pulse number and display the return value in the serial monitor. Upload example code 5, reposition error like before. After the upload is successful, reconnect the serial cable and reset UNO. Open the serial monitor and the tools. The motor runs at a constant speed. Every time the LED light flashes once, the serial port sends a command to read the real-time position error and display the return value in the serial monitor. Run example code 6, read IO status. Open the serial monitor. Every time the LED light flashes once, the serial port sends a command to read the status of the IO port and display it in the serial monitor. 1 means high level, 0 means low level. Click the menu, mode, to view the current working mode, which is CR, VFOC. Run example code 7, set mode. Check the current mode again, you can see that it has been set to sister, VFOC. Click the menu. MA to view the current value. The current value is 1600 MA. Run the example A code, set MA. Check the current value again, you can see that it has been set to 2500 meters A according to the code. Click menu. M step to view the current step. You can see that the current step is 16. Run example 9 code, set M step. Looking at the step again, you can see that it is set to 32. Run example code 10, restore. After the upload is successful, connect the serial cable and reset you know. The motor screen shows reload OK and reboot. The page restarts, and the motor restores the factory settings successfully. The motor needs to be recalibrated, after restoring the factory settings. Click menu, Cal, then the screen shows Cal. Calibration completed display Cal done. Run example 11 code, speed mode as in the previous example. The phenomenon that can be observed is, the motor runs in speed mode. The speed of the motor changes once every time, the LED light is on or off. If the operation fails, the LED light will flash quickly. Run example code 12, position mode, pluses. The phenomenon that can be observed is, the motor runs according to the pulses in the position mode, runs 32,000 pulses 10 circles and stops for 2,000 milliseconds, 
then changes direction and turns 10 circles and stops for 2000 milliseconds, and so on. Run example code 13, position mode, relative coordinates. We can observe that the motor runs in relative coordinates in position mode, runs 10 laps according to the set coordinates, and then stops for 2000 milliseconds, then reverses to the starting point and stops for 2000 milliseconds, and so on. Run example code 14, position mode absolute coordinates. The phenomenon that can be observed is, the motor runs in absolute coordinates in position mode, the motor runs to the set absolute coordinate, and then stops for 2000 milliseconds, then runs to another set absolute coordinate and stops for 2000 milliseconds, and so on. This is the end of the video. Thanks for watching.